there have been a lot of great basketball players at Ohio State. Jerry Lucas, Clark Kellogg, Michael Redd. Who has the record for the single season scoring average and career scoring average at the Ohio State University? Well, no one would know it, but I do. And, uh, and it's, it, it was at a time when uh, uh, defense wasn't as uh, pronounced as it is now. So it was a time when scoring was uh, big time. And what, just so the folks have some understanding of what your numbers were, what it, was your uh, approximate scoring average for both a season and a career? I think it was, for his uh, career, I think it was 28 points a game. And uh, for a season, I think it was uh, maybe 33 or 22.9 or something like that. But to do that, I shot a lot. But you hit a high percentage. 46. Which in that era, particularly, as you, you and I said off camera, if you hit a third of your shots, particularly if you were an outside shooter back then, uh, that wasn't that bad. Well, I had something that uh, uh, was new at the time. Of course, it isn't now, and that was a jump shot. I was the first jump shot around the, the, these parts. And uh, so uh, uh, I don't think uh, the defense wasn't up to uh, catching up with a jump shot like they do now. That's. Uh, it's a silver basketball, and uh, I got that uh, uh, for being the most valuable player in the Big Ten in 1956. And uh, at one time, they said that the silver in it was worth $500. And believe me, that's more than I had. Well, that's a great trophy. Uh, it was the first one ever given to anyone from Ohio State.